Hi guys, hope you are doing well. Here is a quick tutorial on how to do merchant fulfillment or how to ship an order in FBA. Typically when a merchant fulfillment order comes through, you should be receiving a notification on your phone. From there you can check your Amazon seller app to, you, to view the order. You will also receive an email notification. So first of all, log into your seller central account and go to the order tab. Um, so I have already logged in my seller central account. I will go to the order tab and drop down menu. I will click on manage order and open the link in new tab. Yeah, uh, as you can see, we are now in the unshipped orders page, and here we have seen an order that was placed. Let's say we uh, are uh, managing this order, which was placed 20 hours ago, and the buyer's name is Janice, and its order status is unshipped. Um, there are two ways to fulfill the order. First of all, the buy shipping, and then confirm shipment. I will explain both of them. The first of all, I will be explaining the buy shipping option. I will be uh, clicking on this, and we will get over the page. That is. here so uh, whenever you uh, click buy shipping you will uh, get over this page and uh, the dispatch from address which is rpt wb uk which is our uh, uh, dispatch from address and then dispatch date is uh, uh, mentioned here if you want to change the date you can click it and in drop down you can select select one of uh, here okay the next uh, the packaging dimension you you have to show the packaging dimension of your uh, order or of your product uh, our packaging dimension is already shown here but if you want to change here you can click on change parcel dimension and you will be putting on the uh, putting the dimensions here say if your if our product is which is uh, packed in uh, a package which direction is uh, 16 by uh, i will be putting in here like let's say 16 uh, the width is 12 and uh, our package is 12 inches high and this is our packaging dimension i will be click on apply but i won't click it because i have already mentioned our packaging dimension here after that will require a weight um, our packaging weight which is uh, in kgs or grams uh, i will be putting in for example one i will be putting it here then we will be shown this uh, delivery services which are uh, according to our weight, weight our packages weight uh, and we will be selecting in uh, one of them here but if you want to see another option then you you will be clicking on see all the options and whenever you click on this all the options which are available for your uh, package uh, according to your weight of your package all the options are here your estimated delivery date and delivery charges are mentioned so here are uh, we will go with the uh, Harness UK because it is not only the cheapest option but also the faster delivery time so that will be work great so after that this will be our uh, courier services which is available according to according to our weight the next uh, step is uh, we can do is to click button uh, to select our labor orientation here all the labor orientations are available you can select all uh, one of them here but uh, mostly the first one is most preferable but if you want to change it you can select in uh, one of them from here so um, whenever you are finished with them you can click on the delivery confirmation and then click on the buy shipping option and your order is fulfilled i won't be clicking on it because i am not uh, fulfilled the uh, many requirement here but uh, if you want to fulfill the uh, if you your requirements are completed here then you can click on the buy shipping option okay that's all for buy shipping option uh, you can see here that there are some options which are required to be fulfilled the first one is dispatch date uh, which is already fulfilled and dispatch from which is already you can uh, say that rbwb uk you can fulfill it uh, after that uh, carry information yeah one more thing uh, when you enter track information it's good to copy and paste the tracking id directly but make sure you have no space before after tracking ids but your tracking id uh, which is uh, very important and uh, which uh, should be related to your carrier information if you are selecting the wrong carrier tracking id we want process and your order will, will not be processed okay a common mistake the seller make is uh, to select the wrong carrier if you do that your tracking information won't match and you won't have the valid tracking id so i have to uh, put the tracking idea of one two three like for example here okay there there should not be a space like this one uh, space three uh, it won't be accepted by amazon it should be uh, without space one two three like this i hope you got it after that uh, after this process you will have to click on the confirm dispatch uh, i have not uh, selected uh, the carrier option and uh, tracking id i have not put it because i don't have the right tracking id for our order 
so I am not putting in here. So uh, now confirm uh, dispatch and our order is uh, shipped. The next step is to print out the packaging slip. Simply click on the option print packaging slip and here it is. It contains all the information regarding the packaging. You can simply print it out and give it to your customers. Uh, one more thing, uh, when your order is dispatched, your uh, order status will be changed from unshipped to shipped. For example, if, you, if we see the shipped orders, the order status is now has been changed from unshipped to shipped. And it is, its color also has been changed from the uh, red to green. Okay guys, so that's the end of the walkthrough of uh, merchant fulfillment process. I hope you enjoyed the today's video. Do subscribe to our channel and we'll be coming with the more information content on our channel. Uh, if you have any questions, please write it down in the comment section. We'll, we'll try definitely to answer all your questions. Thank you.